Hey, hi there, this is Patrick for Hoo-Ha Sports and in this edition of Fans Life, we are covering the Man City Arsenal game and we're here with some old Arsenal friends. Uh, actually, the fan club is somewhere else, but this is where the real fans are. So we're joining them at Piccadilly and of course, it's a great match looking out for this one because uh, Liverpool won their game match earlier. Um, Man United won their match earlier, so it's all up to Arsenal to stop the strides of Man City. And it's a collaboration of some old players coming back and uh, playing against Arsenal. So we'll join the Arsenal fans as the kickoff just got started between Man City and Arsenal here on Fans Live. It's half time between uh, Man City and also Arsenal. Lots of close calls for both ends of the pitch, but Arsenal should have capitalized on the first 45. We'll come back and talk to the guys. But at halftime here at France Live, together with the Arsenal boys, is Man City nil, Arsenal nil. All right, it's halftime together with the Arsenal fans here at Piccadilly on France Live. I've got Iman and also the Tukang Karot, Kai. Now, Kai hasn't slept for... <laughs> it happens. You see? see, that's why they play so well on the pitch, but not off the pitch. <laughs> A lot of injuries. Now, Kai hasn't slept for 24 hours simply because every time he closes his eyes looking for this match, he thinks of Balotelli. Tapi kan, kalau tengok kita first, half, first 45, memang Arsenal banyak chance, tapi... Tak dapat menyumpatkan gol Iman macam mana pendapat anda? Uh, I think sebab finishing ni lah kot Sebab maybe uh, Van Persie hari ni macam tak jadi je kan uh, So tapi nice back kita ada Still ada Chesney lagi lah yeah. So selamatkan Kak Rai lah Okay Chesney is definitely is the man of the match for the first 45 Tapi kan Kai Where you think is the kekurangan? You know Jovino put the passing in So does uh, Arteta But the final third tu Macam tak ada magic Okay, dia orang macam tadi tengok dari percaya permainan dia orang, dia orang macam confident tu ada because uh, tapi nak shooting tu macam menilang tak ke mana. Dia orang tak mungkin the thing dia nak shooting tapi ke lain perginya. Mungkin lah, maybe maybe buat that one lah, tak pasti. <coughs> But for my side uh, maybe itulah susah nak cakap. Pasti mungkin dia pressure ah uh, because in this game this pressure lah because dia just only one person to score the goal. Okay? Let like Gavino, if pass to Gavino, tengok tersasar. <laughs> but, but do you think peluang yang memang terlepas pada first 45 memang is going to come back and bite you in the second half or not? Uh, I think, yep. Yeah. Yeah. But man of the match first 45, definitely watch it at Chesney. Yes, correctly. Chesney. So with Balotelli, Sami Nazri, Sergio Aguero, David Silva, all these guys up there, what can Arsenal do in the second 45? I think... Van Persie will do, will do something, yeah. miracle I think, and Arsenal will win. So are you going with formation 10-9-1? Uh, That means 9 in defence, 1 one, one, one attacker. <laughs> no lah, for me actually the defence is okay because we have a uh, four centre-back. We have Koshinsley, of course me. Alright. Alright, and then have Malam, Metasaker. That's a very good one. If a three, three also good one lah. Huh? Uh, Metasaker, Bermalut and Koshinsley. If three also, it's okay. Never mind. Aguero ke, Nasri ke, anything, tak ada halnya lah. Okay, let's just say final one. If also one point you get, if Arsenal get one point dekat Itihad, would that be considered okay or not? I think okay lah sebab tu tempat dia orang kan. Ha. So lagi nanti, tak kalah lah. Lagi tak kalah, I think it's still a good run lah ha. kan. Okay. So kalau dekat Emirates, kita orang still boleh menang. <laughs> For me, um, boleh kata... Actually tak okay juga, ah uh, tapi because yalah maybe yalah tempat lawan big pressure, big pressure because uh, yalah city kan, so for me okay lah, okay lah. Yeah, because whenever he close his eyes, he still see Balotelli. So we we'll join the Arsenal guys for the second half here. Thanks a lot to Kai and also Iman. Come on, you guys. Yeah. Disappointment for the Arsenal fans after so much pressure. David Silva puts it in for Arsenal for Man City. So it's uh, Man City one Arsenal nil. Right, it's full-time score together with the Arsenal fans here at Piccadilly. And of course, after United won today and also Liverpool, uh, Chelsea drawing yesterday. But everybody wanted Arsenal to at least get a draw against Man City so that all the groups can be like grouped up together at the top. But not to happen. Arsenal, dia buat semua alright hari ni, except put the ball behind the net. Faiz, what do you what do you think of their performance? I think Arsenal okay hari ni. Memang kita attack banyak, and I think Johat memang the on form hari ni. So 
I think Arsenal okay hari ni. No problem for Arsenal. So luck dia tak ada kat kita. Ajut. Uh, okay. Uh, I think uh, about the City game, they play a tight game. So they do not leave the too much room for Arsenal to create a chance. So every time the key Arsenal player like Bermelon or or Arsenal play, or any Arsenal player hold the ball, so the every City player will come to close to make the difficult for Arsenal to move the ball. So it's always memang you know it's difficult to go to Man City and and get a result. I mean I was talking to uh, Kai and also Iman earlier they say at least one point would be considered at least like a three points at City but it doesn't seem disappointing bukan disappointing sangat. So now is the Christmas run how do you think Arsenal will uh, take this defeat and then go ahead with the Christmas run? I think Arsenal akan move forward akan lagi okey sebab kita still ada Sakna yang belum baik and Jack Wilshere belum baik. So I think bila dua player tu okey kan, Arsenal akan jadi lagi cun lah. Tapi kalau tengok performance dia memang tak kurang and basically I think kalau dia main dengan tim-tim lain walaupun uh, Wigan ke siapa-siapa, I think you can definitely get a result kan Arsenal? Okay, uh, so uh, the big challenge for next game is how to bounce back after the defeat lah. So I think should be okay. So this uh, Compare to other previous game, uh, other team play with uh, City, I think Arsenal give the better performance. Uh. Nearly got the, at least I think, at least draw, but unlucky. Uh. Yeah. Actually, I think it's very, very unlucky, but such a great game. But just one note that I heard all the Arsenal fans were talking about was the fact that uh, with all the hundreds and millions of pounds inside the Man City team, all they can do is just master one goal with the Gunners. So I think indirectly it's a win for the Gunners because I'm standing there with the Gunners but until the next time when we see you uh, Merry Christmas from all of us and of course from the Arsenal fans this is it for Fans Life here on Hoo Ha Sports